I wanted to make sure that I was highlighting some of those experiences um, at the museum. And then I also really wanted to focus on Black and Latina youth because those groups in particular are definitely excluded from the museum narrative often. And so just being able to highlight our stories and show that we are, you know, young and we're fun and we're living life and we go through the same motions that the kids on the other side, of, you know, get to experience. Like, this is all of our stories. And so, yeah. When you walk around and you see all of this photography and you see all these paintings and this, this different view of childhood through these different lenses, I think it just gives you this great overview of what constitutes childhood, not only in like literally seeing it, but also feeling it. Like there's this one piece that I love, it's by William Thomas Williams, and it has like these different hand prints with paint on it. And just that that like energy of youth, there we go, that energy is given because of the different mediums we've chosen for the show. I think they should visit it to get a, a new glimpse into like what contemporary art can be and what it what it can include and who really it can include. Like it includes young people too. Contemporary art isn't just reserved for like artsy adults. Like it's also about us. It's about young folks. It's about being seeing yourself on the wall, seeing yourself represented. Um, so I hope that's what people gain by going to it. Is do you see yourself? And even if you're not young, like even if you are older, do you see parts of yourself represented in this exhibition? Like I go through it and I'm like, yeah, I remember I had a moment like that. So being able to reflect whether you're young or older, being able to connect with some of the emotions that come out of this exhibition too, that's really what I hope people get.